There was an Enigma file in here as well. There's the Marksman Rifle, nice. I love this gun. This is one of my favorite guns in the game. Actually, let's keep this one out, and then the laser craft work. I wonder if fall damage takes away armor. I haven't, I've never really checked. Doesn't look like it. Oh, gee, what? You... You asshole, what was that? He was almost dead already and he just, he just shot at me. I think there's some health in here we can grab, so we're gonna go ahead and run through here and loot everything. And shoot this dude in the face again, even though he's dead, because he was awfully mean to me. <laughs> Just yelled at me and then started shooting from all the way underneath me. What? Rude. Pick up that clip. Oh, there's one of the dogs. I think. Yeah, they were storing them all in here. That's kind of cool. Okay. What was that sound? It sounded like people suffering. was gruesome. Oh, there they are. Then they just fell off. This is a huge bridge. It's like going over an ocean or something. Wait, where do we actually go from here? Ah, there it is. And get as many shots on this guy as we can before he aggroes to us. I think his gun is actually too low to shoot us from where he's standing, so it's good to just shoot him from here. I don't even know if what I just shot at was an enemy. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and rocket launch this turret, if we can. Yeah, we can. That worked out well. Those guys have so much armor. Seems like they gain more as well as you move on to the game. Uh, it, at this higher difficulty, they actually take three shots as well. Whereas earlier they only took... Only took th two shots. Okay. From the marksman rifle specifically is what I was talking about actually. We just threw that grenade for pretty much no reason because we had an extra one sitting right here. I think that might be the last one. They got our shotgun just in case. Kinda hurt. Is that ammo right there? Oh no, it's armor, which is just as useful. So many guns. Yep. So many guns. And there's so many upgrades to them as well. It's kind of one of the things I actually really like about this game. Ah, it's got an Enigma piece. I don't know which one. Okay, yeah, that was this one. We've missed quite a few Enigma pieces on this map. More armor. Alright. 
We went ahead and destroyed this turret before even walking over here so that we didn't forget and accidentally hurt ourselves. Or... Oh, this is an upgrade. We need to grab this. I think we can get it through here. I think. Yeah, we can. Nice. I don't think we're supposed to be able to grab it through there, but we can. Oh, this is the targeted scope. This thing is insane on this gun. Basically, see this field of view on top of, like, right here? If any enemy on that enters one of those little rectangles, um, it immediately hones in on them. And so if you have, like, say, five enemies in these windows and you aim up at them, every enemy that's in a rectangle will get a laser shot out of it, and it just one-shots everything. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous! Shotgun shells. Take them. And go ahead and just reload on all the ammo we can. Try and get our armor up to max as well. While we're here. Hey. Now there's a I think there's a, like, oh no, it's above us. There's a sunroof that we can climb through. Oh, we can, we can get down here. I didn't realize that. We're trying to get to... Wait, what? Oh, nice. We're trying to get to this right here. Because um, that's where the outfit of the guy we're impersonating is. Or the guy we want to impersonate, I should say. So many guns. Alright. And up we go! Deadset's chief research scientist, pal. Well, I'm coming for you, you Nazi fucking spaceman. Well, I'm coming for you, you Nazi spaceman. Got tons of assault rifle ammo. I'm not sure if we have... Yeah, we, are, we already have max pretty much every ammo. Except assault rifle <laughs> missiles. The missile attachment to our assault. Oh, Jesus. Was that supposed to scare me? <laughs> what was that? It made this like loud sound like it was supposed to scare me or something. It's kind of strange. Oh! More sniper ammo. There's our buddy in his helicopter. There's a bunch of enemies down here. Oh, we killed him while he was trying to save his buddy. I feel kind of rude for that. They try and kill as many of these guys as we can before we go down there. Because they kind of go ham when we go down there and try and kill us, so. We want as many of them as to be despawned as possible. There he is. They pop up everywhere. It's like another kind of arena fight, another boss area. Okay. <laughs> what was that? More shotgun ammo, which I guess we could use, maybe. Yeah, this, this level design is just amazing. I know I've said it before a couple times, but it really is great. Oh, ow, we almost died. But luckily there's a health pack right here. Oh, ow, dude, chill out.
Like, watch, we should be able to just one-shot this guy. Oh. Well, almost. Unfortunately, we got... The targeting got dis got disrupted by a couple people behind him. There we go. And it stopped us from murdering him. Oh, lordy. We're just gonna keep recharging this in order to save ammo. Oh, we're out. We could... We could um, use our sniper rifle here, maybe even a little more effectively. But we want to save as much ammo as we can, obviously. Okay, so we're going to recharge this because another guy is going to spawn right as we move past this small section. And he's going to hop out of this train right there. Oh, he already did, actually. Kind of nice. I thought two guys spawned, but it looks like this one got crushed, maybe, and that's what prevented... And since we killed those dudes earlier, it prevented him from even spawning in. It's kind of cool. There was a collectible item in here as well, but we already grabbed it, obviously. Where are they? Oh. Are you kidding me? How did that not kill the guy? Jesus. Rest in peace! Rest in peace. Oh, so I had to just repeat, rinse and repeat this. This thing can be a tad inaccurate sometimes, especially if they move at the last second. So it's good to just wait until they're standing still. Woo! This rocket launcher guy is after my head! A couple more of these shots should be plenty. All right, that got that got rid of the rocket launcher guy. All right, let's recharge one more time. Like we're supposed to. Being. We, don't actually, we actually don't want that right now. There's gonna be a guy right up here we need to watch out for. Enemy checkpoint up ahead. Watch your eyes. Oh. I'm spotting heavy weaponry on the battlements. Got him. Nice. Alright. Whoa, what the heck? These guys can take a lot of tank a lot of rocket launcher shots. Jesus.
Nope, nope, nope. Jesus. Let's regen up to 60. Oh, I got it. Nice. Okay. Oh, yikes. Good. We got to a saving point. Uh, I think we're, we are going to use this weapon here. Almost just fell like just straight off the edge of, of the world. Should be maybe one more up here. Yep, there he is. We killed him with our, our dying breath. <laughs> Jesus. Luckily, this doesn't put us back too far because we got an auto save right below this layer. So, we just need to not walk so close to that last guy. We got kind of anxious to kill him. I should lean out. Yep, there you go. Let's just get the bouncing bullets of the shotgun out. We can just... Oh! There's actually no more. Okay, cool. Let's, um... See what's in these boxes. Could be something cool. Ammo. Nothing particularly cool so far. Health is really helpful here, actually. So, I guess that I guess that's pretty cool. All right. More health. We can. Oh, we don't even need to recharge this. I guess maybe we take this with us? Wait, what the hell? Who is shooting me? Oh. Jesus. That was strange. I did not realize... There's another one, too. These dinguses! Where is it? Oh, there he is. Weird. Okay. We're gonna take this gun with us. Oh, actually, we can't. Oh, we can't. Okay, cool. We're good. Wow, I kind of feel bad for that guy. No, we're gonna die! Oh, okay, actually no, we're fine. I thought we blew ourselves up, but we're actually good. I think that's all of them. Let's open some boxes while we have the gun. Now we can see what's in stuff. No, it's out of ammo! Rip! More rocket launching stuff.
And then we can just grab all of the things. The most effective way of opening boxes. A giant laser machine gun. More grenades. A little more health. Cool, let's do it. I bet there is some form of enigma piece in here, but, you know, whatever. Is that actually... Are we going the right way? Yeah, we we have to be. We have to be. Got a shotgun out. There's some... These bouncing shotgun shells are fantastic. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Excuse me. Oh, I love this area. Cool. If you're lurking, you should come watch this, because this is badass. <laughs> Ready for it? Let's make the jump. Oh good, we caught the edge. Oh no, we are about to fall. Then he cuts his head off with a helicopter blade. A helicopter blade. Who comes up with this stuff? <laughs> All right, you can you can go back into lurk mode now. <laughs> oh Jesus. Okay. Wrecked is right. Damn right. kids with more self-esteem than sense. Bonafide crazy, some of them are. I mean, they talk tough. Yeah, but they can't back it up. That's what I like about you, Blasco. You're the craziest fucker of them all. You can back up every last ounce of it. Every last ounce of it. All right, Blasco. Back to work. Get out. We need to be careful here. It's really easy to die to these rocket launching guys. Alright, I think that should be all of them. Oh, no, there's one more right here. Okay. Make the jump, Blaskowitz. I'll circle around and pick you up. Once you've found Death's Head's chief research scientist and secure his identity papers. Look See ya, fool. Wait, what? Oh, God! Stop! I guess that works. There should be... Couple more... Oh, okay. These guys drop the rocket launching stuff that we have attached to this. All right, let's hack this while we have some time. Oh, I'm so bad at this. I love how he gets mad at us.
Fergus is such a goofball. Alright. This should be the wagon thing. But actually one hits him. Either the guy was really low on health. There may be an enigma piece in here as well. Make sure we look for that. Guess not. All right. Prepare for the jump. No, 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 no. Oh. That actually worked out a lot better than I thought it would. We went way too far on that jump. Way too far. Got the papers. Now what? We need to move fast. <laughs> the Lunar Shuttle leaves tonight from the London Nautica. You will need your equipment up there, but you need to check it. And out. now, Not in the we center. go to the moon. You need a low profile. You may need a shave and a haircut. You certainly need some sleep. <laughs> Literally going to the moon. All right, we're on the moon. Someone left some uh some newsprints here. Berlin, November 15th, 1960. New plans for the construction of labor camps on the moon were revealed today by Dieter Lang. Dieter Lang? Dieter Lang? The head of the lunar base project. Not only will we be able to move undesirable elements of society off the Earth, away from the decent citizens, we can also put these degenerates to work on mining Wolframite. <laughs> Wolframite. Said Lang when he phoned him, phoned him this morning, when we phoned him this morning. Wolframite, a rare mineral which so far only has been found on the moon, is currently being extracted by remote-controlled drones, but the process is slow and inefficient. The new labor camps would be constructed in underground mine shafts and feature almost completely automa automatized correctional technology, such as guard drones and automatic sentry guns, to keep prisoners from escaping. Basically, they want to make a concentration camp on the moon. Oh wow, we found almost everything but the health grade upgrade and one collectible, the very last one. Oh, and one enigma piece. This is a pretty good level on our last playthrough. Hello. I love how this guy tells me he didn't care much for our, my predecessor. Like, what a weird thing to say to the to the person who's replacing the person in charge of you. Afternoon. Afternoon. After moon. All right. I think when we enter this, they're like, what is the head researcher doing? <laughs> we like walk up the luggage belt like an idiot. There was a collectible in here, I think, yeah. Yes, there was. Alright, I think this is our luggage. Carol, yeah. Anya, do you read? We immediately change out of our undercover clothes for absolutely no reason. can you hear me? What's your status? Well, I'm on the motherfucking moon. The mouse on this one. I will clean it out with soap. 
Now, Blaskovich, the goal here is to steal the nuclear decryption keys located in the command module. In order to reach the command module, you have to find a spacesuit and walk there on foot across the lunar surface. Affirmative. I believe in you, William. Affirmative. All right.